Hi everyone, this is Denise Rogers. I teach fifth grade in Manteca, California. And today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on a program called extramath.org. I will put a link to the website in the comment section below. And I chose this one because I'm fully aware that kids that come into my classroom without having a proficient knowledge of their ba basic math facts are at a complete disadvantage and they struggle in most areas of math. Everything is difficult. So what we try to do is get them caught up by using this program. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. First thing we need to sign in and I've already created an account. You will need to do that as well. Um, it is free to use. There's no hidden costs. And the first thing you'll see is a student report. And it shows you exactly what skill students are working on. So you can see Alaba is working on multiplication and she's 81% proficient. Um, Ahmad Ajay, any of these green arrows are, they've already mastered and completed the program. Over here you'll see it whether they are improving or going down. She's got a slight decline there. And then over here you'll see these colored dots. Um, green indicates a 90% proficient for the day. Gray means they did not complete a full session for the day. Yellow means they missed uh, between 10 and 25% of their answers and then red would be um, they did not do well for the day. Some of the cool features on here are, for example, I have a student, Mario, who is really struggling um, with basic math facts. He struggles in a lot of areas. And so what I was able to do for him is I was able to increase his time for each problem he gets six seconds. Normally they would get three seconds. So he gets double the amount of time. You can see he's still not doing terribly well but he did get up to division so that's pretty cool for him. Um, and then I have some students who mastered the program but they still want to do it so they're in what we call the two second club and so then they get two seconds to complete each problem to see how fast they can um, answer the questions. So I am going to go in and log in as a student so you can kind of see what it's like. Uh, this isn't the most engaging program ever but I think one of the benefits of it is the simplicity of it. There's no distractions, there's no, there isn't a lot going on so the kids really have to just focus on the, the facts. So I'm going to sign in as Mario. hope he doesn't mind. Uh, you can see he does well. He does a lot better on this when I kind of give him an incentive for doing well. And lately with testing, we haven't been able to do that. So this is kind of what it looks like. Um, he has to answer this question, 12 divided by 4, and then get the answer. Now, if they get the answer wrong, here's what happens. So it tells you the answer so that you can just keep moving on. So it's pretty cool. Um, I don't know how to get out of this. So that is uh, how it works, how extra math works. Um, the International Society for Technology and Education, or as we know it, uh, the ISTE standards, they have provided wonderful standards for teachers using technology in the classroom and two of those standards can be met with this application um, 2C and 2D ask teachers to create digital learning experiences and assessments that meet the needs of all students. So this is extramath.org. Thank you very much.